Hey, how's it going, guys? Welcome back to Ricky Summer Plays Frostpunk. All right, so we've fulfilled our uh, housing quota, our, our housing demand here. We're still just trying to keep everything warm, so that's just a waiting game and making sure that we overdrive the generator when we need to. Now, depending how long this, this cold snap lasts, I don't know, fingers fingers crossed that we can, we can overdrive the generator for that long. Also, we're not making anything right now, so let's pull the engineers out. Yes, I think it was Chemicals who said that. Chemicals, just play the game for me, please. All right? You're fine. All right. Chems also wants a food law. So let's have a look at the food law. We can we can pass the soup law, the greatest of all the laws. Do you guys like soup? I'm typically not a big fan of soup. I feel like I need some roughage. I need some, some substance in my meals. Um, all right, so we can cook soup instead uh hope will fall slightly discontent will rise slightly and eating soup will cause discontent so just the eating of it will uh will make them unhappy it's like rise up against the soup um we can add sawdust to meals to make them more filling although not exactly tasty or healthy all right hope will fall slightly discontent will rise slightly some people eating sawdust meals will fall ill all right let's just have a look at our our situation over here we have We've got no one sick? I mean, surely we've got... We've actually got no one sick. All right. I mean, that means... That means sawdust time. After that, I want to go fighting pit. Reduce discontent, right? I mean, you know what else we could do? We could do the, the, the soup law in conjunction with the fighting pit to try and balance out the soup. But, I, you know, I'm going to go food additives. <laughs> There you go. Added sawdust for... <laughs> for all that nutritional value. All right. Let's speed on through the early morn here. Illness and health... Dude! What? Wait, won't we get sick if we eat that? Jesus, fuck, you might. We just got 15 people who are sick now? Is that it? <laughs> Surely that's not a coincidence. All right. Hang on. Do we actually have to hang on? Let me go to the, the cookie place. Sawdust meal. So it's selected automatically. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, what's done is done. We'll deal with them. Pretty sure we're, like, we've got enough. Yeah, we can treat 20 sick people. We've only, we've only got 15 currently. So that's fine. Don't even trip about it. Uh, what else do we need to do? Research. Bunkhouse researched. Yes, this is going to make... Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, pause. I want to get that done right now. We've got, we might just have enough steel to pull this off, to pull it out just like the movie theater. So we need to maintain. I think we only need to maintain livable conditions in three of our homes. So if the edge of the generator is there, that's the edge of our range. So these two rows need to be upgraded. So I'm thinking, like, it's probably wise to start outside and move in right all right one two ah damn it three four five <laughs> whatever it's fine i misclicked don't worry about it happens all the time baby will it will it build in time yes it will the 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 cold snap is coming that's this, this is what all right we're gonna overdrive now there you go. So these boys, if you haven't caught on, the bunk houses have a, if we go over to housing here, a base heating level of two as opposed to one, right? So they're, they're insulated. They can withstand the, uh, the cold just a little bit better. We need to set another research project. Holy damn. Uh, outpost, maybe. I'm happy about the factory. Lighter scout sled. So does this speed them up? 50% faster, that's pretty in impressive. Oh, flying hunters though. Yeah, 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 we need that. Hmm. Yes, and we can afford it too, good. Because we're running out of food. I mean, we're alright now, but... Where do we get that food from? <laughs> uh, look, it's fine. Don't worry about it. This is still staffed, it doesn't need to be staffed. I wonder, hang on. If we staff it and close it it still counts as staffed 
Alright. It's fine. Whatever. So, let's speed on through the freeze. Temperature fall. Here we go. Let's monitor the temp. Hang on. How's that? Oh, look. Our coal reserves are not the best. So, that's, that's gathering coal. Well, the, hang on. The, the shift hasn't started yet. So, let's wait for... The, oh, no, ha, no, it has. Is coal going up or what's the deal? Yeah, right. We're maintaining an equilibrium of coal. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. This is because we didn't go to winter home. I mean, the, the result would have been the same. Make no mistake. It's just, it doesn't let you rest on your laurels. If you don't... Uh, if you don't actively go to winter home, then it pushes this on you anyway. I'd love to know what these things are. Everyone's got them. Is it a light or what's the deal? Uh, we found an exhausted man at the edge of our city. He said that he came from winter home, a settlement located not far from here, and that he was the last survivor. Winter home is dead. Everyone's dead. There's no hope for survival in this accursed wasteland. You're all doomed. You must escape. Those were his last words. We can't escape to anywhere. The whole world is a frozen shithole. Okay. We are alone. The news has shocked everyone in the city. There was uh, there was supposed to be many settlements and construction crews here. People living normal lives in homes heated by generators. But we're alone. Hope falls. Hope falls. Here we go. <laughs> now the fun begins. <laughs> I'm ready for it. Hold a town meeting. Call that kid who was hugging his mother's grave. We'll have a party. <laughs> it's too much? Too bleak? Oh, dude. All right, we need to raise that hope. Winter home has fallen. They're all dead. How will we survive here without any, any help? We have to go back to London. No, don't go back to London, your penises. There's no hope for us here in the frozen desert. People start to gather uh, as news of the fate of winter home spreads through the city some of them want to drop everything and flee to london panic is starting to set in i mean though i gotta i gotta i gotta ask why not just set up the generators in london unless it's even colder in london and that's the idea you're going north because it's a little bit warmer uh we're gonna go order and discipline uh this time because last time i i went order and discipline but didn't build anything from it if memory serves we we didn't get to that point uh, I'm, I'm pretty confident that we'll be fine this time around. So, order and discipline, neighborhood watch, uh, new building watchtower. Okay, so let's go to order, watchtower. People living near watchtowers are protected by their neighbors serving as watch members, making them feel much safer and more hopeful. Okay, so this is going to raise our hope a little bit. And luckily, we've, uh, we've furnished ourselves with a very large area of housing now we might have to destroy a house to put in a watchtower and i think i'm actually very okay with that in fact that one right there get out of here <laughs> get out of here buddy okay um we've almost gotten okay we we can't survive the full winter the full cold snap whatever you want to call it with the generator and overdrive it's it's not going to happen but we will survive the the task here the unconvinced want to leave sir you've convinced the majority but hope is low a group of our people are still so scared that they want to flee the city for london in 15 days they've come to try to change your mind you say order will save us nonsense what are we going to do orderly decide who to eat first when we start to starve if we don't try to reach london will end up like winter home. Get out of here. I can't use you. Or I'll eat you. It'll be fine. Your people are divided. Some of them are so scared that they plan to leave the city for London in 15 days. They'll try to convince others to join them, preying on their discontent. Fear may lead people to desperate acts. Maintain peace, give people hope, and manage their discontent to guide the city safely through the looming social crisis. It's fine. So I have... Um, played well oh jesus we've got so many unemployed it's beautiful i've played well past this section of the game and i am confident that i can defeat the wind the, the the londoners i can bring them back not all of them but a lot of them okay 
So let's put in that watchtower. I realize there's a house there that's not being serviced. So maybe we'll we'll swap that out with something else with a utility building. Beautiful. Okay, promise fulfilled. Ho prizes. How you doing, baby? All right, so eventually, I mean, these homes here, the bunk houses, are actually comfortable, right? So we can we can drop the um the overdrive and they'll they'll be livable because they're insulated so all we need to do is turn the rest of these houses into bunk houses which we can we can afford but we also oh god we also need to build the uh the sky hunters so how much food do they provide 30 as opposed to 20 i think with our upgraded boy um it's worth it my dudes what's the heating level on that heating three so we can build them a little further out yeah yeah right there you go um let's restaff the cookhouse with the children because we've got some food now all right and we need to staff the watchtower which is fine we've, we're actually swimming in engineers we've got more engineers than we know what to do with i almost want to build another scout boy but let's not get crazy okay uh the hothouse might be a way to go Eating lighter scout sleds. I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the scout sleds. It's only 30 wood. I think we're good. I'm happy with that. Alright, so let's have a look at the tower. There you go. What do you know about that? Listen, you can build even bigger towers later on. Look at it go, it's it's so it's so oppressive. I fucking love it. I love the way once the city starts getting dense, it's real oh, it's real fucking nice. All right, people, bunk house. Bunk with... Won't you bunk with me tonight? <laughs> Gone off the rails. It's fine. Don't worry about it. All right. Uh, these ones should... Then they, actually, once we kick off the overdrive, which we're doing now, they're not going to be fine. They're now cold. That's all right. So we'll upgrade them in short order. Uh, we are getting steel now, which is fine. So let's speed up. I'm ready for it. I'm ready for you and your rudeness. Okay, so what? Hang on, what is it? It's, it's just ten. Boom. Boom. All right, so we have two fifteen, and how many houses? One, two, three, four. Is there a quicker way to see how many houses we have? Hang on. Just highlights them. Yeah, I just I just want to see if there's any if if we can delete one without anyone being homeless. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So one hundred forty. <laughs> We've got houses somewhere else though. Oh, over here, over here. Yeah, yeah. We got some over here. That's fine. Look, we can build more. Whatever. I, math. Get out of here with your fucking math. I ain't got time for you. Oh, actually, we do. We do. What am I doing? We actually do have homeless. I was under the impression that I had, I had housed everyone. Far from it. So forget about that. Forget what I'm talking about. Uh, we still need to house people. On the bright side, they're all warm. Except for our blokes in here, they could they could use uh, an upgrade, but we haven't got the resources yet. That's fine. That's fine. So we can't pass any laws yet. We've just gotten a winter home now. Jesus. <laughs> the streets of the ruined city are littered with scores of dead bodies. The city, the city chronicle describes the shortage of food and citizens' increasing despair. The following squabbles, riots, and dis, um, riots and descent into anarchy. Fights for dwindling resources and the eventual starvation. The last entry. God forgive us. We're eating our dead. Look, it's fine. It happens to all of us. There's no hope. Okay. We got two steam cores from it, though. I appreciate that a great deal. Snow cliff. Let's head to the snow cliff. Oh, that's right. We do we do need another um, another scout party because we lost our other one. All right, let's do that and let's go to the American camp those damn americans i don't know where this is set i mean so we've gone from london we've gone north so are we still in 
Britain? I don't know. I assume so. Or maybe not, because I think there was a ship involved, so maybe we've gone to, like, the North Pole, essentially, which is ironically warmer than everything else. Okay, so, my, my... We'll join the line. No, 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 sir! So, the people who want to leave the uh, leave for London have successfully urged their friends and neighbors to join them. People are more easily persuaded because they have little hope in our ultimate survival. I'll give you fucking hope with some dirty big towers. Okay, so we just need to complete our research. What was I going to do after that? Don't rightly know. It's fine. Um, healthcare is fine. You know, we've got beds to spare. We've got our faster sleds. I'm happy about that. Uh, why is this not fully staffed? absence because it's going to work okay there you go and now we're we're fully staffed it's beautiful what next okay outpost factory resources i feel like we probably oh, jesus we probably should deal with resources right now do we build another gathering post I feel like we should, you know? I almost like the idea of destroying the factory. Uh, so you know what I'm going to do? I know King Gath said he didn't find it very useful. But I'm going to say, let's let's research the hothouse. We do, or we will have the steam cores to build it soon enough. Uh, let's inspect our flying boys over here. Yeah, they're functioning and staffed. Okay. We can't build any more just yet. Now... I'm pretty sure the coal thumper can, can, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Sustain. Can sustain more than one gathering post. Question is, where do we build it? We could put it right there, but it's not an insulated boy. You know what I'm saying? We also probably should research heaters, <laughs> which allows us to heat individual workplaces. And I wouldn't mind building some more homes. Okay, so maybe we build, build some more homes and then we build another tower? It's a tough call. It's a tough call. Let's just speed on through here. Our food is incredible! We actually, dude, we actually... Okay, alright, 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 alright. Calm down. Resource Depot. Resource Depot. You know what? I've solved our problem for our lonely little home that's not getting any exposure over here. Let's get rid of it. Get rid of it. And we're going to build a resource depot in its place to store all that beautiful excess food. Okay, we've got a waiting scout party. Snow cliff. The hole in the snow cliff leads to a small chamber. Someone lives here, but the lonely human figure we saw from afar has disappeared. It might be the sole survivor of Winterhome. Okay. The refugee from Winterhome. The man we've seen from afar was nowhere to be found. Searching his burrow, we found a diary of a scientist who fled Winterhome. After the starving city fell into chaos, its leader, an army captain, appointed himself an absolute ruler. He tried to impose order using force. Plenty of people, disgruntled, deserted the city and most of the others rebelled against him. I'm cool with them. Resources will be taken. Food and a steam core, I like it. I'm actually gonna bring our boys back. Because I need those steam cores. We're packing three steam cores. I need them, dude. All right. What do we got over here? Timely intervention. Sir, a child climbed the generator. Yeah, I love this one. I uh, slipped and fell, but was thankfully caught by a neighborhood watch member who was on patrol nearby. He then escorted, es escorted the child to his mother and gave them both a good talking to. <laughs> I love it. It could have ended with a broken leg or worse if it weren't for our watchman. A neighbor commented, we're lucky to have them. You damn right. You damn right. Do we get a do we get a hope bonus? No such luck. Rude. Rude. Alright. Let's shimmy on down through here. What do we got over here? Storage. Uh, I would like to store food rations. Because we've got all the food rations in the world, please. Hothouse researched. We can't build it just yet, but I... We can't even use the ghost of it. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. We'll get it soon enough. We'll get it soon enough. Coal is probably something we need to think about because it's... it's the coal is starting to scare me. Coal is starting to scare me. So... 
I reckon we demolish... We have no use for the factory just yet. I mean, we can build... No, we can't build automatons because it requires steam cores. So, we've currently got no use for the factory. Let's demolish it. We'll get a few resources back. Uh, we can actually build the hothouse now <laughs> because we've got a steam core from it. That's good. Uh, what did what, what did I want to build? The gathering post. Yeah. All right. Well, let's have a look where this, the hothouse fits into all this. Not well. There's going to be a little gap there. Could slip it in here. But again, this is a, no, I need... <laughs> Um, we might just have to put up with a gap, you know? Alternatively, you know what we could do? Let's, alright, let's put the hothouse there. That's going to produce food, by the way. It's like a greenhouse. Um, let's go to resources gathering post. Can we slip in? I don't think we can put two gathering posts in there. I'm just thinking this might be enough space for the care house. Do we already have the care house? Cemetery. I can't remember. I don't think we built the care. Oh, no, no. There it is. We do We do have the care house. Never mind. Amputees. We've got amputees now. Do we actually have amputees? No. It's just telling us about amputees. Don't worry about it. All right. Yeah. It looks ugly. It really does. But I'm going to do it. It's just, it's it's the smartest thing to do, I think. What do, what do you got for me? Sleeping outside. Listen. Fine. I'll provide housing for 29 people. That's only three houses. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. All right. Let's staff this boy with the kitties. And what do we got over here? Uh, a potential steam core. There's uh, not a living soul in the camp. We found about a dozen... What? Emaciated... Emaciated bodies? Surprisingly, most of them were amputees fitted with prostheses. Interesting. Can we grab their prostheses, please? <laughs> uh, the American camp was well supplied with everything except food. Searching the tents, we found more victims of hunger. Most of them have badly worn but sophisticated artificial limbs bearing a company symbol. Tesla manufacturing. <laughs> We can only bury them and take their equipment. There you go. All right. Take their equipment, please. And move on to the temporary settlement. So we're going to go to Tesla City. This is another city out there. Uh, not a requirement for the story, but fun nonetheless. We don't have enough children. <laughs> All right. Uh, staff the hothouse with... How, 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 uh, hothouse will produce one food? One raw food? But how often? I think, I think we need to wait for it to... Um, to be working hours. All right. Speed on through. I'm ready. I'm ready. Ooh, uh, a new law. A new law. So, purpose, guard stations, morning gathering. Okay. Uh, each morning uh, gathering will slightly increase hope. That's good. Guard stations. Guard, st uh, guard stations raise the hope of people living nearby. Guard stations lower the discontent of people living nearby. You can use guards to break up protests. You have, to, you have to build two guard stations and discontent will rise slightly. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Dude, listen. You're gonna give me you gonna give me the option to build towers? I'm gonna build towers. We've also got patrol, prison, propaganda center, agitator, pledge of loyalty, forceful persuasion. Dude, I'm into this. Alright. Now, I, I, I've got a feeling that maybe the guard station can be built over the top. Yeah, you're doing... All right. Uh, so, how much does it cost? 15 wood, 10 steel. Only 7 wood and 6 steel if we build it over the top of the other boy. Now, does that increase the range? It's actually a... No, it's the same range. That's fine. Uh, yeah, it's like objectively better. So, let's just put it down. Coal coal though coal though um i'm so i'm sorry kids we're doing a couple of double shifts we're doing a couple of double shifts because we need the coal so what can we do to alleviate this coal issue we've got more than enough workers so let's go to resources uh coal mining 
It's gonna... We, we need a Steam Core to build? That's a little bit rude. Okay. So we've got... Where we've got an income of 48 coal an hour. You'd think that'd be enough. <laughs> uh, discontent is, is currently through the roof. Not a great place to be. One of our people has died. Child dies of overwork. Dude. A boy working on an emergency shift has dropped dead in front of his friends. Everybody is shocked. He was in perfect health. Just tired. I, I do not believe this. We must make sacrifices to survive. Discontent will rise. All emergency shifts currently in progress will end. Hope will rise slightly. All right. Well, it's currently working out. I know we've kind of wasted an emergency shift, but it's working hours anyway, so they'll keep working and we'll get a, a hope boost. Okay. Please furnish me with the coal that I require. It's fine. Oh, look. We've just caught them coming in. Look at them go. They've gone hunting in the skies. <gasps> How about that guard station, though? How hot is this thing? Ah. No, I want a center on it, dude. How hot is this thing? <laughs> I love it. All right. Uh, that is working. We got, we, we're actually doing really well for food. Better than I think I've ever done. Cookhouse is working. We're good to go. <sighs> Resources. We can't yet build anything. Steam steelworks. Nah, no, we're fine with that. Okay, so we got one steam core, I think. Oh no, that's, they're still out there. They haven't come back yet. Okay. The settlement uh, seems to have been abandoned. It consists of several tidy uh, wooden shacks that are now completely empty. An upright boulder stands at its center. Okay. Memory of injustice. The center of the settlement is marked with an upright boulder. On its roughly planed face, someone chiseled the following. May God forgive the genius who sacrificed human lives in the name of progress, for we can't. Exiles of Tesla City. We won't touch the monument, but we decide uh, to dismantle the huts for for wood. Yes. And we get a steam call from, from it. Good. So we can go to the walled colony. Or Dreadnought Landing. Let's go to the walled colony. I actually don't remember what that's about. Okay. Uh... What else? So we need another watchtower. Let's do that while we can. We've got the steel for it. So that's the range there. So if we put it here, I mean, <sighs> we've got that. We've got that lame gap there. Damn it! It's the it's the hot house's fault. Let me think. What are the... I mean, what are the chances that I can pull this off? I don't think there's any chance. No, that's not... That's just not happening. We also need to provide shelter. I almost forgot about that. Okay. Listen, let's bite the bullet. It's probably going to look ugly, but let's just do it. So we'll put the tower there and build some bunk houses. So we need to build three. And we have built three. Good. Okay. How you doing? So that's two needs, I think. Build a man two watchtowers? I've built one. You want you wanna hang on. Oh watchtowers! Fuck. I now now okay, now I also need another watchtower. So that's the guard station. Now I actually need an, an additional watchtower. So what I should... Fuck. Okay. Uh, no, you know what I'm going to do? Cancel that. We'll play it smart. Put the watchtower down there. And then we're going to build over it with the guard station. It's going to count. Okay. So we have come back with resources. Um, fresh water springs, shrouded cave. I like the idea of the fresh water springs. Sounds idyllic. Uh, we might also consider putting together an outpost building soon so we can start getting more coal because our coal situation 
scares me deeply. Okay, uh, coal mining optimization. Maybe. Uh, heaters. Or do we just upgrade? We haven't got the <laughs> haven't got this deal for it. Uh, let's go for heaters. That's probably something we should have done much earlier on. So now we can build coal mines. We can put one here. That's pretty nice. That's a this is a nice location for it, I reckon. Yes. Boom. Uh, can we slip in a bunkhouse here? Is that going to be serviced? It will be by heat, but not by the tower. Right, I might leave it then. There you go. Cool. It's looking good. Uh, staff that boy, please. How are we going? Is that going to fulfill a need? Wait for it to be fully staffed. Shelter promise fulfilled. I've built your second watchtower. Unless... Oh, fuck, does it need two of them simultaneously? <laughs> I, I hate what I've done. I hate what I've become. Okay. Uh, do, do workplaces benefit from the watchtower? No. They do not. So am I going to have to build a watchtower? I think I'm going to have to build a watchtower just because, you know? Just somewhere. Just to fulfill... Fuck. Alright, fine. Just do it. Just get it done, guys. Just get it done. And staff it. Real quick. Good. Okay. Good. Now we can demolish it. <laughs> And build the guard station over the top over here. I think I've done it. I think I've I've circumvented the bureaucracy on this one. Cold homes, captains, some of people concerned about the low temperature in their homes. They quite sensibly point out that it's easy to fall ill. Listen. You'll have to start heating two of the cold homes within two days, then keep them heated for two days. So who is cold? Oh, it's only these two boys over here. That should be an easy fix. I mean, I hate this situation construction-wise. I actually kind of want to just, like, move it. Which I can do. But I kind of built it now. Okay. Guard station need fulfilled. Yes. The hope is rising. The scouts... Numerous snow shelters expertly built from blocks of hard-packed snow huddle around cold, burnt-out campfires. A deathly si silence hangs over the colony. Yes, hang over me! Daddy, uh, s some of exiles are still alive. Just barely. We could try to bring them to our city, although they might die on the way. One of the dying held a diary to his chest. We read the last entry. Exiled from Tesla City with food and fuel running out, we sent the strongest among, among us to search for help. They're our last hope. We're afraid this refers to these poor Yankees. To, the, to the, the poor Yankees we buried. Okay. Escort the exiles to the city. Leave the exiles to their fate. Rob the exiles of their supplies. The scouts will rob the dying exiles and leave them to die. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Let's rob them real hard. As soon as we started packing the equipment, some of the exiles stirred from their death-like slumber and seeing us, started to ask for help. We explained that we first had to stow the supplies for the journey. They seemed reassured and didn't try to stop us anymore. Hello, darkness, my old friend. <laughs> I'm a bad man and I'm okay with it. It's, it's, all, in the, it's all in the name of survival. It's in the, the power of love is a, it's a, all in the name of, stop in the name of love. All right, we've got more engineers than we know what to do with, so let's start getting them mining, I guess. Hey, look, we're not in a bad position. Uh, our coal is no longer dropping like a, like the top 40 charts. I, I don't know, I'm just, 
I'm not smart enough to come up with a, a witty analogy for that one. We've got so much, we've got more food than we know what to do with. We actually need to build another food depot. That's incredible. I've never been in that position. I'm, I'm very grateful for it. Uh, so next episode, we just need to heat some homes. I'm cool with that. Thank you guys very much for watching. Taste the game. Be excellent to each other. And I'll see you next time. Ricky Summer, out.